Hey everyone, this is what we're going to be making today. I'm going to show you how fast and easy it is to drag and drop content like this from a folder directly into your design and deploy this in seconds. Design in minutes, deploy in seconds. Hey everyone, Will McReynolds from KP9 Interactive, creators of WorldCast. What we're going to do today is I'm going to show you how you quickly can drag and drop content into the studio. And you can do this on Printcast, Showcast, or Geocast. We're going to use Printcast just for the sake of time. And I'm going to show you how you can quickly create content. And I'm also going to use uh, Canva, for example. I'm just going to call this drag and drop. What's called drag and drop. Let's go next. So you can upload your own file. In this case, I'm just going to go design on Canva. I'm just going to grab a flyer. It doesn't really matter what the design is. I kind of have a real estate motif going for this particular idea I have. So I'm just going to go uh, real estate. Uh, I mean, I can grab any one of these, but I just really want to uh, make it. Actually, this one, oh, this one looks pretty good. It looks close to what I have. So of course, you can edit the content right inside this. So we can go like KP9 homes. I'm going to go export to Printcast. Now what the studio is doing is it's analyzing the image to make sure that it's going to be good enough for using. In this case, we've got like a perfect score. So I'm going to go create. If you if you get a less score, you can go to style guide and find out what makes a good marker. <clears throat> okay, so it's all, all the information is there. In this case, we're going to go create. Now that we have it in the studio, usually I would go to the side and bring in the images one to one, right? But this has been available in the studio for a long time. All you have to do if you have your content already made, just grab it all and simply drag and drop it all right into the studio. You get a preview of every model. So you can make sure it's the right one before you proceed. Well, let's go proceed to that. Now for this particular one, it's a green screen video. So I'm gonna go filter green screen. So it'll go back and get rid of the green screen for you. You can also go automatic subtitle generation, which will give subtitles on the screen. First, again, for, uh, for sake of time, I'm just gonna leave that off, but you can do that and it would add subtitles to your, your cast. So I'm gonna go proceed. Now all the objects are here. So now the content's in, we can move it wherever we want. All right, I most likely sped that up because uh, you know, that only took about, uh, I don't know, probably about maybe a minute and a half or something. I'll go back and, it didn't take long. So basically I have it all set up now and the content is drag and drop as well as WYSIWYG, so wherever you place it, that's where it's gonna be on the content. You can assign hot keys, you can add buttons. You can go actually go over here to images and go create button. So in this case, we'll just go uh, click me, or touch, touch me? I don't know, we'll put that anyway. <clears throat> and it, we can uh, change the colors of it. We can change the font. We can do whatever we want. Looks good enough. All right, so let's go export as image. Let's go upload. We'll just put it over to the side at the top. Let's bring it down a bit. Maybe we'll put it right over top of the video a little bit more. So everything, everything is in 3D space. So the further out you have it, the further out it's going to be in, in augmented reality. So we can now add a URL to that. It can be a phone number as well. We'll just put KP9, we'll just put broadcast.io. And good enough, I'm going to go save, save and publish. And this literally takes seconds. Once the screen comes up, you can pick free or you can upgrade and go $10. Or you can pay it for multiple packages. What upgrade it does for you again, uh, if, you have, if you haven't uh, followed any of my other videos, it gets rid of the banner across the top as well as gives you deeper analytics. Uh, so that comes in handy. Instead of just seeing how many views you've had, you get where, when, and how long. Now, nothing creepy is in down to your location, just general location, like the city that you're in. Another thing that we get asked a lot is how, what's the view limits? There is no view limits on, on free or upgrade. It's, it's, you get millions of views. We don't care. So I'm just gonna go check out. We're gonna get a QR code. I'm gonna scan that. Now this QR code could be used to put back into your print after it's generated. And so I'm gonna preview now. So instead of printing the image, I can just aim at the one in front of me. Obviously, the, when I scan the QR code, it comes up with the instructions, line up image, we'll do that. And all the content will be placed exactly where we had it. Uh, 
if I touch the touch me button, it will go through to the website. It's just that simple. I can't wait to see what you create.